Good morning, children. Happy Advent. I'm coming to you this morning on the first Sunday of Advent. What is Advent? Maybe you all have an Advent calendar at home what, that helps you count down the days to Christmas. Well, this morning I want to share with you a little bit about the reason we celebrate Advent. Now, I don't know about you, but I'm not always very good at waiting. But we believe that all good things, like maybe that pie that you had for Thanksgiving, that takes a lot of preparation and time to bake properly, all good things that take time are worth waiting for. And we believe that celebrating Christ every year at Christmas is worth waiting for. So we have some practices that we like to invite everyone, including you, to, um, to observe during the season of Advent as we wait for Christ. This is an Advent wreath, and it's one that I hope you will enjoy making. I made this one, and it was so much fun. Um, you, you may be picking one up today in your Advent wreath kit uh, if your family's picking some of these bags up. Um, but if not, don't worry. You can still make it at home. You just need a little bit of um, Play-Doh and a couple of candles to put in it. And I added some glitter as well. Now, each of these candles we will light on the four Sundays in Advent. So you light a purple one, a purple one, a pink one, and then a purple one. And each of these candles stands for something different. We have some prayers that go with each Sunday, and they represent faith, hope, joy, and love. So the invitation is to practice lighting these candles and watching as they get smaller and smaller and smaller throughout the season of Advent. The lower the candles get, the closer we are to lighting this candle in the middle, the white one in the middle, which is the, can the white candle that symbolizes Christ's arrival. I hope this will be a fun project for you children, but mostly I hope you will enjoy taking the time to pray with your family and, um, and prepare for the arrival of Christ. Amen.